Hiya, welcome back to Mega Man 8 Bit Deathmatch. I checked the opening cinematic to see whether it was different. Also, Iceman, you're looking a little weird here. <laughs> Listen, I got half of ice. It's it's kind of fucking awkward. All right. Good. You don't have to have that conversation again. Delightful. Ready? Let's cut them down to size. You got to say it like man. Maybe. For a while since I've seen your fight, show me how much you've improved. Yeah. Why don't you give me a beep? Okay. Good work, Time Man. Good. You're part of the solution, Time Man. Let's get started. Mega Man, The Wily Wars. Our teammates are Cutman and Electman, which is a significant downgrade. Well, could anyone be a downgrade from, uh, from base? I had a viewer ask me why I, uh, called him Bass a few times. On the off chance I wasn't being an asshole. The reasoning behind that, uh, leads into Mega Man 8. The voiceovers for that game, uh, which are so majestic and wonderful, as I mentioned earlier in this series, uh, call him Bass. Whereas, you know, Bass is the thing that makes sense, given Mega Man's name is Rock, uh, Treble, Bass is Dog, you've got Blues, which is uh, Proto Man's name. Very clearly a musical theme going on here. Not Fish. Anyway, I'm doing very poorly. I don't really have an excuse as, uh... It's only been like 12 hours since <laughs> I did last video. So I don't really have a, something I can lean on here. Just apparently my brain sluggish. I mean, much as the case with Mega Man and Drought, uh, I'm not too familiar with the Wily Wars. Compared to all the other games thus far, so... Memory is, uh... There's far fewer hours of experience for me to draw on. We'll put it like that. Also, I'm not finding any crutches sufficient enough to carry my ass to victory, so I'm just trying not to get my ass killed. And thus being like a burden to the team. I was hoping these crash bombs... There we go, especially with these enemies clumped up together. There, yeah, at least that was a two for one. I done with a leg man. Yeah. Not good. I guess we get to enjoy that sweet, sweet jam from Mega Man 3's Game Over. There we go. Like, I need you to get on, like, a caught on a corner or something, you know? Have I already forgotten my sniping enemies when they come around corner strategy? I appear to have. There we go. Remember your past bullshit maneuvers to bamboozle the AI, Grimoth. That's important. Exploit them. Of course, uh, I have other enemies to, or other allies to distract my enemies. There we go. Just had to warm up. Bullshit engaged.
Hey, you want to join me, Snake Man? Unfortunately, Slash Man didn't continue to follow me. It was unfortunate. Out of energy juice? You know, energy juice. The thing that we use to shoot our weapons. Generic brand energy flavored weapon juices for your weapons. Distilled over a period of 700 years. That's important. Okay, well then fine. Here comes the Genesis unit. Alright, sure. Bring it on. Howdy. I do, in fact, have all the nerve. Don't do that. It's cheating. Ow. Surprise! Ow. Alright. Holy shit! Apparently I am hanging on by the mere sliver of health. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Anyway, that wasn't a, some sort of secret thing that we unlocked. We gotta, gotta get better at Genesis Man here. I'm not doing a good job of dodging that at all. Especially whenever he jumps on my flank like that and just lights me up. And then he did the reflection thing right in my face. Uncomfortable. easy when I get that correct. Okay. I did interrupt the flow to bring me back here, huh? Alright. Fun. Or whatever. Looks like we're gonna have two new teammates. Oh. Well. Okay. Sure. Wall. Yeah. You know, I wouldn't have minded a few more cracks at that boss. As I don't feel as if I really got the pattern down to reliably beat him so much as I discovered uh, his hiding location super fast in that uh, phantasmal copy move. Electric shock. Uh, how about no? Not shotgun blasting. Bubble Man kills me again. I was heavily weakened. Rush for me. Alright. I'm operating in three dimensions, bro. Three dimensions. Getting my ass kicked in three dimensions, bro. Just shoot a whole bunch. Ground man, you don't belong down here. But there's ground under the water. My whole, like, ice wave attacking the ground doesn't help when people are in the air. Food for thought. Flee! Energy! Thank you. Get him. Yeah! Bring it, ground man. What you got? You want a piece? You don't want... Not energy. You want. 
Oh, my body. Oh, needles. The smartest robot master. Help me. Magnets. Oh, I jumped in the spikes. Aha! I will deprive my team of this point. <laughs> Part of my cunning scheme did not allow the uh, the opposing team to win. They can't score the last point if uh, I score the last point, you know? They're like, wait a second, what kind of fucking... You see, they'd be at 14 right now. Then you'd be like, well, then you would have won right now. Don't question my life. Shit. I saw that two for one, like, no! <laughs> no! Don't eat bait. Too beautiful to be eaten. That's not true. The prettier they are, the harder they get nommed on. That's my wisdom. You're welcome. Hmm. Alright, mutually assured destruction there. I like this whole flamethrower move. Pretty fun. Even though it's a lightning flamethrower. I don't discriminate. You can be whatever element you want to as a flamethrower. Eddie! going on up here? We ain't got no time to be up here. A genuine place, though. Get him, Eddie. You see, uh, you see Bright Man there? What a fool he was, taunting me and luring me into an ally. All part of his cutting scheme. Truly, he is the smartest robot master. <laughs> Wise and most powerful. I'll get you with my rings. Yeah. He said. Knowing damn full well that wasn't true. Here's like I am distraction material. Break dash. Climbed up all this way for fucking break dash. Get the fuck out of here. How many of them were there? Four or five? Clumped up? And I've missed every single fucking one of them? I don't want to talk about it. Master of time, hell yeah! Couldn't use my time power anymore. Good. Thank you, team, for carrying my dumb ass. Time man and oil man, they did it. Better than trial, that's for sure. Phew! I will pay. I don't have any pockets for money. Y'all take credit. Hmm. This is, uh... This is an arena, isn't it, folks? Our water foe does not come down here after me. I gotta get my ass back up there. Okay. <laughs> you know what? Well played. You got me. Flung me into the fucking abyss, you did. I'll just fling myself into the abyss. For whatever reason, I thought I had the same jumping power above water as I do below water. That's just not true. That's not how Mega Man works. Alright, you don't get tired of shooting. Understood. Hey, 
maybe I'm better off just trying to have this confrontation down here. He says not actually able to hit in the same way. You know, here I thought I could uh, do what the AI is able to do, and uh, you know what? Looks like uh, my attacks hit the arena. Lord. Those attacks were specially designed to pierce the net. You know, you know how it is, right? I have Search Snake. The most grand and powerful Search Snake. <laughs> Alright, fine. Just don't lift the way I expect you to. Sure. You can make that joint. Oh, what's that? You want to stay up here without grabbing weapons? We'll do some sort of aqua shield barrier thing. Just make my dumb ass dizzy. <laughs> okay, I do not have the endurance to keep circle strafing in this tiny square. That is a limitation of mine. Freely admit it. But one of my criticisms of this game has been the the tiny boxes, the small boxes you end up fighting bosses in, and that certainly has not been helped by giving me an even smaller box. Fuck me. <laughs> I can't just stand up there and take that fire. man looking motherfucker. How about you give me some room to stand on this platform? He's like, why would I do that? It's not like you. Yeah, and I have to look out for that move, too. Now we have some exploding Metroids. As one does. As one does. Not I not that I have a good explanation for why I tried to use search snake on it, but I did. Can't say this is my least favorite boss, but I'm not enjoying it. Behold the power! If only I could pick the arenas where I fight you bastards. Anyway, Search Snake's the way to go there. The flame through it doesn't deal enough damage. Which is why I was electing to use it. A couple rounds back. Good. Okay, they mobbed me quicker than I had anticipated. Thought I'd be able to escape the water in time, and I was wrong. Maybe the flamethrower's for them, huh? Get shot in the back as I leave. And I'm reckoning that we just get flung off the, uh... 
the top part when we deal enough damage. But we can contend with the mines. Yippee. Look at that. Almost like the slow evolution of knowledge is happening. Can't say I wasn't given the tools to win. <laughs> Much like how I couldn't say I wasn't given the tools to win whenever I was fighting Gamma. I get dunk on up here. Yippee. Yeah, I do win it this time. Compare that to the first boss fight where I wanted to spend more time there. I feel like I kind of lucked out without getting better. There, I spent too much time. Alright, folks, coming up next, we continue to play around in this chapter and uh, get bullied by the Genesis unit, because I'm definitely not the one doing the bullying here, guys. 100%. That was the point where the video was supposed to stop, Hotkey. <laughs> <laughs>